it's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. Good afternoon, everybody. Today is Thursday, October 10. It's 10 10. It's my friend Holly's birthday. Happy birthday, Holly. It's also Eric's birthday and Dana's birthday. So happy birthday, Eric, and happy birthday, Dana. Yay. So yesterday I had a sandwich with my homemade bread, onion, cucumber, red bell pepper, and lettuce. And then I had for snack some almonds and some popcorn. Then for lunch I had peanut butter and a banana smoothie and some popcorn. It was a popcorn kind of day. And then for dinner I had a salad. It was lettuce, almonds, raisins, pineapple, green and red bell peppers, onions, nutritional yeast, garlic powder, crushed red pepper, dressing, and of course, lettuce. Then, in the evening, I was feeling kind of sad because I was really missing my friend, the chocolate tort. <laughs> really missing it. I'm like, I really miss that yummy chocolate tort I made. Then I remembered, I remembered that you, Cookie, made a video about how to make little truffles for when you're feeling like you need something sweet. And I thought, I'll make some truffles and I can eat those and then the craving will go away. So I looked up your video on how to make um, truffles and I'll probably put a link to it down below. And it said you needed carob powder, honey, and coconut oil. Well, I had cocoa powder and I did have honey, but you had to melt it down and I didn't want to because, you know, it had gotten kind of crystallized. So I thought, ooh, I have agave nectar. And I didn't have coconut oil, but I had vegetable shortening. So I figured I'd give it a try. So I used cocoa powder, agave nectar, and vegetable shortening. And I made me some truffles. And they were pretty good. I'm sure they would have tasted better if I would have used all the right ingredients, but they were still kind of tasted like truffles and they took that chocolate craving away. My dad thought they were pretty good. My mom thought they were just eh, but she's not really a truffle person. So, but I got to use one of your recipes sort of because I had to substitute every single ingredient, but <laughs> it was still fun to make them. So, uh, still lost a tiny bit, although in all honesty, I didn't eat until noon because I was so busy and I didn't weigh until later. So it says I lost 0.2 pounds, but I think that's because I didn't eat and I weighed later. So we'll see what tomorrow really says. So that's all I have to say, I think. It's been a good day. I'll see you guys tomorrow. <laughs> Bye.